Coming in at number one for 28 years in a row, our longest reign for any breed to be number one is the Labrador Retriever. Labs are great dogs. They're all around versatile. They do well with children. They love stimulation. If you have a high activity level, this is a breed for you. And so this is the number one breed, correct right now, as far as popular? It is the German short haired pointer named Hugo. Come on out, Jeff. And we really want you to meet this breed because it is really gaining Whoa. in popularity. It is an energetic breed, it's a very beautiful dog. And this year it has broken into our top 10, knocking the Yorkie down one. So it is coming in at number nine. Uh, right now, the TSA is using German short hair pointers in the airports because they're very calm and they have a huge work ethic and they won't take anybody's face off. So they're, they're very popular from that because they're just very easygoing dogs. They just want to be with you. You may be familiar with the breed because one has won Westminster in the past. The top 10 breeds going backwards from 10 to 1. Number 10 is the Yorkshire Terrier. Number 9 is the German Short Hair Pointer that you just met. Number 8 is the Rottweiler. Number 7 is the Poodle. Number 6 is the Beagle. And now let's introduce you to number 5. Number 5 is the Bulldog. Coming in at number four is a breed that is also the most popular breed in New York City, the French Bulldog. Again, a really great adaptable breed, great for apartments, very smart, moderate exercise, and low grooming. And at number three is a breed I'm sure you are all familiar with, the Golden Retriever. So at number two, we have a dog that excels at being a working dog and a service dog, extremely loyal, very brave, and you see them all the time, the German Shepherd Dog. And Wolfie is our adult, and Frankie Lynn is our adorable puppy. Third time visiting here. Wow.